Let's take a look at the fifth platform preview of IE10 in the Windows 8 Consumer Preview with improved performance and more support for HTML5 and richer web applications. Let's start with an example of improved performance in this platform preview. This demo brings together CSS gradients, opacity, transforms, and animation along with HTML5 audio. Here each Firefly is rendered as a div with animated CSS gradients and transforms. Hardware acceleration of CSS in IE10 enables fast and fluid rendering with smooth visual effects and a high frame rate. Let's look at this in another browser. Here in the latest version of Chrome, you have the same demo running the same markup, but you have a much lower frame rate and you don't have the beautiful glow effect with animated gradients like you do in IE10. Next, let's look at another example in IE10. Here we have the Metro style beta fish built entirely in HTML5, SVG, and CSS. What's neat is this demo uses no JavaScript code to animate the fish. The whole experience is achieved through declarative markup and CSS. Watch how smoothly the fish zooms under my fingertips. Notice how it continues to animate as I move around the page and zoom. Each element in animates independently with crisp edges even when zoomed in, and the fish feels alive. As I move around, Windows is re-rendering the SVG in real time on the GPU at 60 frames per second for the new zoom level. And this is what's possible when you let HTML5 take full advantage of the underlying hardware. Next, let's look at fast and fluid multi-touch support in IE10. This game is built with familiar HTML4 patterns developers use on the web today, where each object is an HTML div with CSS styling and JavaScript animation. I10 support for multi-touch and pointer events enables fun gameplay on touch devices, and it works great with the mouse too. Let's look at this in another browser. Here, again, in the latest version of Chrome, you have the same demo running the same markup. But you'll see that the animation is choppy, making the gameplay less smooth and fun. Let's look at one more demo in IE10 and how HTML5 allows new possibilities like accessing your information offline. In this demo, I connect to Facebook and I can see my photo albums. I can choose to download and view those images when I'm disconnected, just like an app. I'll download this one. When I disconnect, I can still see the view and view the albums I've downloaded even when I'm offline. IE10 is the first browser to support the latest IndexedDB APIs with support for storing blobs, so this demo doesn't run in the latest versions of Chrome or Firefox today. With the latest platform preview, IE10 continues to deliver the performance and foundational features developers depend on to build great applications. You can download the Windows 8 Consumer Preview with IE10 today and try these demos and more at ietestdrive.com.